Good afternoon guys, it's July 27th on a Thursday. We are here at the Loaded Cafe here at Bellflower, California. We are gonna get, let's see, you guys can see some of the menu here. We got some waffles and pancakes. But uh, let's go to the burger section real quick here. Hi. Well, thanks. You're welcome, honey. Enjoy. Alright. So, this is what I got. We got like a double cheeseburger with freaking um, bacon, barbecue sauce. So, this is what we got the crunchy barbecue bacon cheeseburger. So, it looks yummy. Look at the honey mustard. Wow. That's legit. Pies are fresh. They have a nice firm filling of potato. It's not mushy, but it's fresh as hell. Nice crisp. Thanks for inviting your fans, Anna. Well, wow, this burger's gonna taste amazing. Look how this burger is. That's a big burger. Let's give this a shot. Ooh. Yeah. Look at the cheese. Ooh, this is big. That's, I know. Ten dollars. Ah. Ah. Let's get this shot right here. Mm. Wow. Hold on. Dang. This is good. Got on 200 fans. Am I bleeding? Probably one of the best burgers I have right now in a while. <laughs> I'm just gonna carry that over. Wow. Burger packages are awesome. The bun is not holding up well though, but you know what? I appreciate a burger this thick though. I really do appreciate that. These are real onions, guys. You can taste the onion. Yeah, that's real onion right there. They ain't faking this. The onions still have that horrible breath flavor, but they fried them up so good. The inside of the onion, oh my god, that's. Everything about this burger right now. Let me try the tomato by itself. Fresh tomato. The fries though. These are real fries. See if I was running a burger restaurant, it needs to be this thick. It needs to be this thick, guys. Perfect, crispy. Wow. Hold on, let me go to see it. That's a barbecue sauce right there. <laughs> Oh, this barbecue sauce. Best, probably the best barbecue sauce too. This thing could be on ribs, chicken, whatever barbecue sauce they use. It's on point. Nice and tangy, it's sweet, smoky. Man, it's missing a little bit of spice. 
but I'm pretty sure the sweetness canceled out that spice a bit higher. Possibly a smoking barbecue sauce, ready to um, but it has a nice tanginess to it. It would go good on ribs, chicken, burgers, french fries. They made the perfect barbecue sauce for this meal. The honey mustard, nice and tangy, sweet. It's seasoned too. I never had seasoned honey mustard. Yeah. The only improvement I would make, I would just probably change a different bun. A sesame seed bun, probably a potato bun would be nicer. Has that diner style feel burger that's gonna fill you up. It's legit, it's fresh, you know, good cow. I love the barbecue sauce on this though. Mm. Um, what's up, Mountain Dew? How you doing? Oh my god. Honey mustard again. Look at that. It's crazy. Oh, hell yeah. I'm eating a uh, crunchy barbecue bacon double cheeseburger. Um, it's about, uh, I think it's $9.99 plus tax and all. The honey mustard's extra, guys. Um, I'm really enjoying this. Uh, wow. I'm gonna, next time I'm gonna make this medium rare. You can tell that this is well done. It's a well done burger. I'm gonna make it medium rare next time. Forgot about that. But uh, I always try, the first time I try a new place, always um, cook it the way they have to cook it. Killer burger. Guys, make sure you go to um, Lodi Cafe, 10, 10, 9.99. Um, crunchy barbecue bacon cheeseburger, two beef patties, two pieces of cheese, bacon, barbecue sauce, fried onion rings, lettuce, tomato, Thousand Island, on a sesame seed bun. That I wish it was a potato bun or a brioche, but I'll take it. It's perfect. Probably one of the best burgers I ever had. And uh, go out and go to to the loaded cafe. I might get dessert, so this video might not be over. And uh, yeah, we'll see.